Hey guys, today we are in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee for the opening day of the Harvest Festival. There's going to be a bunch of pumpkins lit up later. Are you excited about seeing those, Bobby? Yeah, I'm excited about trying all the different fall foods. Yeah, we kind of <laughs> wrote down some of the stuff we're going to try. So we're trying stuff that's not available all season long. So are you ready, Bobby? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. Look at the size of this. 1,600 pounds. And I guess Andy Wolf. Yep, in New that? York. New York. How big is this one over here, though? This one might be bigger. Let's see. 1,200. No, that one's bigger. 1,600 pounds and 1,200 pounds. Wow. Love all the pumpkins and the fall colors. This is my favorite season. That is a lot of them. Those are all real. Those aren't I think fake. We could put one of those up in the back of our yard, John. Yeah, we could try. And it goes around this way too, doesn't it? I mean, they're just everywhere. It's pretty. Bobby stopped to look at the wreaths. There's some really pretty ones, but my favorite one's down here. Yeah, they're all pretty. You want to walk? That's your favorite one, the scarecrow. The scarecrow and he's coming through the wreath. The four down here we have this little Christmas ones here. They have kind of two seasons wrapped into one here. They got fall and Christmas. Yeah, that's a, that's a nice one. They got a lot of them. Okay, guys. I'm going to take a quick walk around here in the daytime, see what it looks like. Then we'll come back at night. And see, look at this guitar, Bobby. That's nice. Playing music. That's pretty. We have some quilts with some pumpkins embedded in them. This is going to look pretty tonight. It's about 5 o'clock, so it's not quite dark enough. Yeah, I'm gonna walk up through there. That is cool at Christmas time. Still looks good now. Ran across this. Looks like an old wagon. It's kind of creepy in that tree. It's a nice setup. And they got some smoke coming up here. Dollywood would be a perfect place to do a haunted attraction, but they don't do that. Just a kind of a, a fall thing with the pumpkins. Nothing scary. Bobby, how would you like to meet the spider that did that? No, thank you, but I'd be pretty upset if you put a big web right. like that in my house. Yeah, yeah. You wouldn't want to clean that, would you? You might want to be afraid of me. You probably would. You probably would. Let's go down here and look at this. Why don't you win me one of those pumpkins up there? I'm not real good at games. We all know Got some spiders. There's the spider. There's who made that. Is that what you're going to squash? We'll squash him. Let's take a look at him. Look at this guy. Ah, he looks pretty friendly. Looking forward to seeing this tonight, Bobby. They do. It's just a big pumpkin guy taking a break. This thing out, guys. This thing is awesome. Then they have some uh, characters out here meeting the kids. Little pumpkin guy. Have a bunch of pumpkin toads in here. And. A ride that's about ready to drop. 
any second. We'll ride that, Bobby. Okay. Nice little cemetery set up here. Check out Bobby in the small down there. You look pretty creepy down there in that yeah. small. <laughs> we have a quote from Dolly. I make a point to appreciate all the little things in my life. I go out and smell the air after a good hard rain. These small actions help remind me that there are so many great glorious pieces of good in the world. Dolly. Right in front of that beautiful pumpkin tree. I guess that's what you call that. Okay guys, let's start our tour of the great pumpkin luminites. These are bubble machines they're selling to the kids. The lights out for the kids to buy. All right, here we go. Let's go check out this guitar up here. Check that out. Oh, that's pretty neat. They got all these pumpkins in the front with musical notes on them. So it looks a lot better at night than what it did in the daytime, but it still looked good in the daytime. Let's go over here and check out the quilts now. There is a lot of people in here. Look at these quilts. Those are nice, aren't they? Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, those look good. Could be just a tad darker. I like how they have the purple lights going around. Adds to the effect. Let's head through this. This is creepy looking. Yeah, you thought fog and the purple. You thought it was creepy earlier today, didn't you? Yeah, now it's really creepy. <laughs> it is. That looks neat, though. Yeah. I like the purple. I do too. Just waiting for an actor to come out and scare us, but it isn't going to happen. Got a fog. I like that smoke machine back there. I do too. It always makes everything look yeah. scarier. Here's the spider web. Still just a tad too light for that spider web. We'll go check it out though. Now let's check out the spider. Oh, it's a little darker. That is so neat. Who was that, guys? That is neat. Look at those spiders, Bobby, ready to drop on you. That is neat. So, so much nicer in the, when it's dark and you can see how bright they are. It does. Let's go check out the pumpkins over here that are cut like spiders. Oh yeah, arachnophobia. That's what it feels like, doesn't it? A bobby will probably like this. You got some fall leaves. We got some squirrels out there.
Check out the fireworks. They do a really good job, don't they? On yeah. Days. Don't know if I like this one or the spider better, but this is cool. Look at this, guys. <laughs> That is so cool. And he's surrounded by all these other pumpkins. That might be my favorite. I love that spider, but and it is hard to beat that one. Have some fireman pumpkins. Got a fire. They got the axe. Fireman's hat, fire hydrant. Like Splinter's trailside snacks is all lit up. This big tree. Look at this big stack. This is where they normally have the uh, Christmas tree. That thing looks awesome from here. Can't wait to see it up close. Got some scary faces and some happy faces. And over at the Mystery Mine, they have the bats all over. That is pretty impressive. Favorite one so far or the spider? I think I like the spider. Now look, is that that character we met earlier? Yes. Now he's lit up. He was lit up when we saw I him. I didn't, oh, that's pretty neat. Headed back into the Wildwood Grove section. Look at all these pumpkins. All right, pick one of those up. Take them home and carve it up. I have those are nice sized pumpkins. They are nice. They look nice and shaped perfectly. They do. That looks pretty good. These are all butterflies. All right, let's head out here and see if we can find this huge butterfly that's out here. Pumpkin butterfly. And all the butterfly pumpkins going around it. That is so cool. Look out the pumpkin faces. Sorry, guys. Pirate ship, Bobby. One of my favorite rides. I do. We got over here. Look at all these sunflowers. How pretty is that, huh? I like sunflowers. It's probably one of my
So what do you like, this or the Christmas better? With the lights. Oh, I really, I like the Christmas ones, but like I said before, fall is my season. So I love the pumpkins, the colors of the orange, and the, you know, purple. Oh yeah, that's. So that's I'm good. about to say this, and still it's warm. <laughs> it is, right now it's all right. Oh, yeah. Look at the ducks. This park has some beautiful little uh, waterfalls going around it. Lumberjack. Now a lot of this stuff is in front of what theme ride it's in. The firemen and all that. Look at that down through there. Checking out this area with all these owls. Now this is... Fish, didn't want you to miss it. Pretty how they got the blue lights, looks like water. Alright, let's head down. I know, I was noticing that one. But these owls are hanging up here in these trees, they're so cool looking. inside this kind of light there you there it is like a flickering LED bulb that's a big bulb too well looks like that's it Bobby 
We walked through the whole thing. There's a casket we saw earlier. And we'll go on the other side, this ought to look pretty good. So this is the other entrance you come in from the opposite side. Well, this looks better than what we started off the night with because it's darker. After having a fun-filled day at Dollywood's Harvest Festival, an opening day of the Pumpkin Luminites. What did you think about them, Bobby? It was a fun day. And I first wanted to say the weather was perfect today. It was perfect. I think it might have been 68 degrees yeah. and sunny. Beautiful. Um, we walked around during the daytime and saw the pumpkins, the way they were carved, and some of the decorations, and they were really cute. But as the nighttime came, they got a little bit eerie or spooky. I mean, mm -hmm. not bad, but you know what I mean? The lights, the purple lights and the orange lights, they were beautiful. They did a nice job. A little bit of fog was in mm -hmm. um, some areas and a little bit of music. That added to it. It did. It really always adds mm -hmm. to it. But they take so much time for the detail of those pumpkins. I mean, Toronto. the faces and the different areas like the they, themed the areas. Themed they cut them areas. The themes. Someone put a lot of time and effort into that. Great job. Yeah, they did. It was a it was a great time. Now we're normally into the scarier stuff, but that was fun. That was really neat to see. Now only thing I would say for them, this is like uh pretty early and it get, doesn't get dark till uh what? About what seven thirty seven thirty twenty oh eight and the thing closed at nine. Yeah. Now later in the month in October it'll get darker faster so you can get more time looking at them, but they should stay open I think till ten o'clock. In the beginning in September when yeah. they open back up. I even. agree with you because the weather is still really nice and there's so by the time it gets dark you're trying to hurry because yeah. you want to see everything. Even though we did have enough time, I wish they would have stayed open a little bit later. Yeah, they too. should have stayed open, but I'm sure the employees want to go home. Yeah, but we had a great day. Time. It was a great day. <laughs> so if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Yeah, so until we meet again, J and B have left, left the building. building.